All right, good people, time for the Erykaism of the day. So my birthday was two days ago and I, I of course, you know, we're on quarantine so I couldn't have a party and, you know, though I didn't have a cake and all of that. But when I tell you, I felt so loved on that day because the amount of happy birthdays and I love yous and you mean this to me and you mean that to me that poured in, it just made me feel grateful uh, it made it count like the fact that you pour and you give and you go, you know, and, and what I do, I pour, I give, I go, I talk, I encourage, you know, I try to be as real with people as I can. I try to share an authentic experience. Even if I meet you in an airport, I, I try not to just wave and keep going. I try to really give a people, give people a piece of my heart. I know some say I would never do that. That's too much. You're trying too much, Erica. But I'm telling you, it comes back to you when you work from that kind of place of really pouring out to to people and believing that the love will come back to you. It does. Well, it did for me. It definitely did on my birthday and it's still coming in. Let me tell you what the scripture says about working with your whole heart in Colossians 3 and 22. Whatever you do, work at it with all your heart as working for the Lord, not for human masters, since you know that you will receive an inheritance from the Lord as a reward. It is the Lord Christ you are serving. And even Romans 2 and 6 says, God will repay each person according to what they have done. So what are you doing? How are you living? How are you sharing? How are you giving? Are you pouring out? Um, are you pouring out of, of a real well? Are you saying I'm only giving you that much because I don't want to give you that much? Uh, I'm just, I'm grateful for the love. I'm grateful for uh, for every card, every message. I, I literally couldn't get to my messages until the next morning. I was still responding to text messages, just loving messages. Some that just said happy birthday and some really shared their hearts. So it was an amazing day. Um, so that means I'm going to keep going. I'm going to keep giving. I'm going to keep loving and trying to lift up people, keep pouring out, knowing that God will always refresh me, Go, knowing that God will never leave me in a deficit if I'm trying to give the love that he's given to me. And so I, I thankful, I'm thankful, very, very thankful for that love. And that is my Erica-ism for the day, ladies and gentlemen.